I got an offer from um, a German promoter. A German promoter came over. They actually thought I was an American, but I was the only one that they saw that they actually wanted out there. Now, um, Bret Hart wanted to go out there. And Bret said, like, do you think you can get me in? And I made that a condition. I made that a condition. I, I said, if you want me, you know, now I knew what kind of money I was getting. And first of all, I tried to use that as a bluff. I didn't want to go to Germany. I used that as a bluff and said, hey, listen, if you don't give me like a lot more money, I'm going to Germany. And he played my bluff because he didn't think I'd go. But anyway, if I say I'm going to do something. You'll follow through. I've got to do it, never mind what it is. So anyway, that, that is what I did. I made a condition, and it was me that actually got um, Fred Hart to Germany. Now, another brother, Keith, who I really didn't like, came up to me. He said, you got, oh, he asked me to get Neidhart in as well. I got Jim Neidhart out there. It was down to me that both Neidhart and Fred Hart actually went to Hanover. Then Keith Hart came up and said to me, you know, you've got Neidhart and Brett over there. Can you get me in? I said, I could, but I won't. He said, why not? I said, I don't like you. And I didn't like it. He was nasty, nasty, snotty little thing. Uh, which of the, because you work with Keith, you work with Brett, you work with Bruce, I believe as well, uh, among the Hart boys, which of the one, which of the Hearts did you think was most talented? And at the time, who, who did you think was going to go the furthest? Um, Brett. That's why I thought he could have, because he had more size, he was the biggest of the Hearts, you know, size wise. And out there, that, so, you know, size does count. Mm. You know, Bruce was no big. Bruce wasn't any bigger than me. Mm. 